Okay, so let's do a little brand trip tea really quick. hot y'all hey y'all and welcome back to my channel as y'all can tell from the title we're filming a full get ready with me ignore look at the bathroom look a mess girl but that's what happens when you're rushing to get ready okay obviously i'm filming a full get ready with me you guys are gonna see me do my makeup my hair we're gonna chit chat okay there's a surprise in here from nars <laughs> my outfit my fragrance all of that but before we get into it like i just said fragrance i want to give a huge shout out to scentbird for sponsoring today's video we love a hoochie sponsor okay if you guys don't know what scentbird is i don't know where you've been at okay scentbird is the try before you buy y'all know these perfumes begin expensive and you can't just be spending your coin if you don't know what you like okay so scentbird has made it very easy to bridge that gap okay they are providing you with all kinds of different fragrances designer names brand names niche brands i mean they got everything girl i got some fragrances here that i was so excited so let's just get into that really quick first of all the first one i got parfums de marley i've never smelled that before it is amazing look at the packaging are you freaking kidding me so to lock it here it doesn't spray but then when you turn it this way it's unlocked and then you can spray the perfume i'm not gonna spray it because i was wearing this earlier it smells so good i was like oh i gotta buy the full size bottle of this i get the hype now y'all didn't overhype this this is great hello i also got gutal petite chevy the notes on this look at how are you kidding me like come on the notes on this scent are pear rose vanilla and freshly cut herbs let's see what this one is giving Oh, this is for my fresh babes, okay? This is giving spring. Oh, if you like light, refreshing, dainty, this is right up your alley. The next one that I have is Totus Love Me. Pink grapefruit, lychee, peony, fibrous, jasmine petals, and cedar wood. Oh, this is giving springtime too. Let's see what it's giving. This is for my fresh, fresh and fit babes, okay? Definitely springtime, like 100% smells so good very fresh it's giving laundry and then i also want to note guys like they open like the scent is right here in the center of the packaging so like if you like certain colors and you want to switch it around you can do that too i love the new updated cases these are adorbs and they come and these cute little drawstring bags that also say scent bird. like are you kidding me and then the last one that i have is anishio musk therapy it smells so good are you kidding me? This is the one I'm wearing today. I hate to spill the beans. So good. Listen, the notes on this are bergamot, white magnolia, mandarin, white sandalwood. Oh, guys, get this one. If you if you don't get anything, get this one. Love. And this these Anisha was expensive. Anyways, I'm gonna stop talking because I know y'all wanna see me get ready. Now y'all know I'm gonna save y'all some money, okay? You can use my code, Aaliyah's Face. It'll save you 55% off of your first fragrance. It's gonna get you your first month about $8 or so. Yeah. If you're a perfume girly and you just don't wanna spend the coin on a big bottle if you don't know you're gonna like it, Sandberg got you covered, okay? Like I said, link's gonna be down below in the description. Shout out to them again. Thank you for sponsoring today's video. And if you wanna see me get ready for Zena with NARS for Fashion Week, then just keep on watching. Hi, everybody. Let's start getting ready because I'm already running very behind. It's 6.40. We have to be, well, dinner starts at eight. So I have to do my makeup, hair, and get dressed. Um, I hope you guys don't mind this angle. Uh, it's different than how I normally film, but how to make it work. I think it's kind of giving. I mean, minus my mess. Don't pay attention to that. The lighting just might be funky because I have this like vanity in front of me. So yeah, getting ready for dinner. Last night with dinner, I, last night with dinner. Last dinner with NARS, I literally still can't believe like we're here. <gasps> by this, by the time you guys watch this, you would have already seen the vlog. So you guys have seen the room and just like the whole experience and tonight to be honest. So hope you guys enjoyed that. So I'm gonna be starting with my brows like normal. Um, I'm using my Refi pencil per usual. So normally, you guys know I put my brow gel on and then I fill in my brows. Lately, I've been carving them out, then filling them in, then putting the brow gel on. So a little bit different of a process, but it's been working out for me. To carve out my brows, I'm going to be using the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. And I'm not just using this because I'm on a trip with NARS. If you've been watching my videos, then you've seen that I started using this again before this trip even came up. We love that for me. I can't lie, y'all. I'm like pretty mellow like right now. My energy level, 
is very low so i'm gonna try to like hype myself up before dinner because it's like it's our last dinner i feel like once i'm cute you know the vibes will return once i start putting my clothes on and feeling myself we'll be back on on the sleigh oh sh my eyelash is like stabbing me what the hell is going on <gasps> what's happening no like this is unacceptable what's stabbing me guys no there's like literally that was so unacceptable i'm gonna listen to music too while we're getting ready tonight <laughs> I don't know what that eyelash, I have to re-glue it on, but girl, it was taking me out. I don't know why it was doing that to me. <laughs> I feel attacked by my own eyelash. Oh, what the hell? That's an ugly eyebrow. That is an ugly eyebrow. I'm like so sad it's our last night here. I've been having such a blast. To be honest, I could live in this hotel room. Don't know how much that costs, but I'm definitely gonna ask. Can I just move in, please? Okay, so my brow's pretty harsh. That's pretty dramatic for me. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and put concealer all over my eyelid. High key too, it's like I'm not hungry, but I'm like, I could eat though. Like, <laughs> brow gel, brow gel, brow gel. Patrick Ta on the brow gel. Ow. One brow down, one more to go. Ew, all the edge control in my edges. Disgusting. <laughs> okay, I need to focus because I don't have all the time in the world. <laughs> That's another thing. I just be moving so slow, y'all. Like, I can really do my face in like 20 minutes. I'm over here lollygagging. Like, I don't got somewhere to be. Good enough. It'll be fine. No one is going to be like, her eyebrows. Well, they might, but who cares? For eyeshadow, I am gonna use my little Fenty palette right here. Um, this is their face and eye palette. It's the Sunstalker. Um, and I'm just gonna like use this, these like darker browns in my crease. Real simple, real cute. Being here has just been insane. It literally feels like I'm in like a dream. Like, you know, I don't really feel like I'm like living. Like, I'm living, but like it doesn't feel real. Like, I feel like I'm gonna wake up at my house tomorrow and be like, yeah, those past two days were like, in my brain you know but like no this is like real freaking life i don't know it's just crazy like you guys know i went on my first ever brand trip last year and like that was just like crazy to me like i couldn't believe that that like happened to me and then i've had so many work opportunities since that do involve traveling but i haven't done another like brand trip where a brand is like hey like we want to bring you here and treat you to this really nice stay and bring brand awareness around product and like I just I, I, it's just so crazy and for it to be NARS too like I love NARS NARS is one of the only people who I still get PR from I love NARS classic brand great products and the team like Jamie is so amazing Jamie if you're watching this hey girl I freaking love her and me and Jamie have been she's been my like PR girl like my my contact for NARS for years and we finally got to meet and she's just the sweetest and I just love her and I can't thank them enough for like inviting me here like it's sick okay so I fixed my eyelash then I'm gonna take this NARS eyeliner they just was oh, this a lip liner oh never mind this is a lip liner I'm not using that I'm using my <laughs> make forever eyeliner this is their aqua whatever I don't remember the name of this but I'm gonna tight line my eyes with this but what I also like love about this trip I talked about this in the vlog is that they brought all women of color majority black women on this trip and to me like it's just crazy like you know what let me get some q-tips uh, what was that oh you guys that was you guys oh no I'm so sorry <laughs> okay so Sorry, I didn't mean to make you fall over. I have the do not disturb thing on. Okay, thank you. 
Okay, so I kind of fixed the eye situation. Sort of, not really. So we're gonna move on to skin. I don't know what that is. I think it's a cake. Mm -hmm. Using my same old primer. This is the Tatcha. Y'all know I get my little minis. Oh, and I still have to get my hair. Okay, let me go wet my sponge. Can you roll this out, okay? Have a good night. Thank you, you as well. Thanks so much. Guys, I'm gonna go look and see what it is. But if you watch the vlog, then you already know what's over here. I don't know what they brought. Let me go see. But there's one glasses or something. Oh, are you kidding? <laughs> ah, is this a cake? Okay, I'm gonna come meet you guys because we're definitely just gonna go ahead and hit this though. I don't. <laughs> I don't know what this is. This is such an, this get ready with me just took a turn to craziness. Look at this. So they brought this in. Is this a cake? I don't know what this is. I mean, they didn't give me a fork or anything, so it can't be cake, right? And then look, wine glasses and wine. Ah, I mean, champagne. You know what I'm saying, girl. Hold on, let me get my phone so I can take a picture of this because this is insane to me. Oh, I don't. Like I was just saying, this shit is unreal. I just, I, I can't, I'm laughing out of, uncom I'm uncomfortable. Because I'm just like, why do you guys keep doing this to me? It's so nice. It's definitely something you can eat. Cause like, I can smell it, you know? But at the same time, I'm like, is it something I can eat? All right, let's pop open this champagne. Screw it, I had no intentions of drinking champagne before dinner. But this to me, I feel like if you brought this while I was getting ready, look at the fireplace in the back. This is such a nice shot. But I feel like if they did this while I'm getting ready, then you're letting me be late. You're allowing me to be late. This is a Louis Roderier. Roderier? I don't know. I've never had this. It's champagne, baby, okay? I wanna like champagne shower it, but this room is really expensive. <laughs> oh shit. No, we're not ready, Aaliyah. Oh my God. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Woo! We're just gonna pour this bitch all the way up, okay? All right. Thanks, Nars. <laughs> okay, let me finish getting ready. All right, here we go. Oh, it actually, the champagne smells really good, though. Like, really, it's a sweeter champagne, for sure. I still have to figure out if that's a cake. Hey, I hope you guys didn't mind the little interruption. That was my phone. I am clearly a wreck. So what were we doing? We were getting ready for skin. I'm almost done with my makeup. So of course for my foundation, I'm using my Makeup by Mario. This is in the shade 19 C. Now when I start putting this on, don't come at me about how much darker it is in my face. Y'all know I got a tan. My body is like 80 shades darker than my face. Wow, this champagne glass just looks so cute. I need to take a picture with this too. So adorbs. Okay, so I'm putting like a pump and a half on the back of my hand. And then just dotting it on the face but okay so that totally just screwed up my train of thought but the fact that like nars is like yeah alia like we find you valuable we not that i need them to find me valuable but it's like recognition within your field is absolutely just like jaw dropping i mean obviously it's business right but it's like it's just exciting it's it's a marker in your career you know it's just really exciting always blend this down um when you're trying to match to your body by the way um this is the refi brush y'all know i started using this because of monet and i love it to just kind of get my base layer of foundation like spread out and then i go over it with a beauty blender you'll see um but yeah it's just such a great feeling and i'm just so grateful to be here and i've worked you know and i've been doing this for a long time so it's like wow like for people to be like we see you it's like dope and then on top of it like i told y'all the whole trip is all women of color mostly black women like you don't get to see that like we don't get to see brand trips that are just us so for them to be like you know what this is important and during black history month period i look like a peanut butter baby <laughs> um y'all look at how big my ear holes are from when i used to have gauges it's fucking sick <laughs> ew okay i need to like get my base done because i'm looking wild out here <laughs> whoa to be here to be experiencing this and then on top of it y'all all the girls are amazing like i'm crying 
everybody that I've like been on with this trip has just been so great. We've been having a blast. No bad vibes. Everyone's so fun. Like I'm having the fucking time of my life. High key, I'm like, New York is like giving lit right now. Like I'm kind of like, not lit like club lit, but lit to me. Like I'm looking at New York and I'm like, hmm, hmm. <laughs> I'm like not a New York girl. It's so funny, earlier um, we were all talking about that and they were like, yeah, you give me Miami vibes, Aaliyah. And I was like, Miami? I was like, is it because I like the sun? And they were like, I don't know, you just give Miami. And I was like, damn, is that a good thing? <laughs> I'm just having a blast. I love being able to get this experience. I'm so grateful for it. I'm, the fact that like you guys are able, like I don't know if y'all realize, I talk about the power. I do this every single time I get an opportunity. It's sick, I sound like a fucking broken record. But seriously, like as a viewer, and this is why like with cancel culture and things like that, I'm like, you guys have all the power. You have so much power. Look at how you're changing our lives right before your eyes. You know what I mean? Literally, and I'm sure everybody on this trip, you know, feels the same way about their supporters and stuff. Like, um, that was caramel, the first color that I put down. Now I'm putting praline down. I'm gonna blend this out, y'all. See, oh, whoa, that was a lot. It'll be all right. I'm just gonna blend that out with my beauty blender. The lighting in here is like really bad, so I actually don't know what I look like. Probably not as bad as the, my camera's making me look right now. But we'll see but yeah it's just like you have so much power you guys control all of this you know what i mean collectively if you decide you know what we don't support this i don't like this or whatever like you really have that power you know what i mean y'all changed my life like this shit is sick like i can't believe this is i can't believe i'm sitting in this room like <laughs> if you didn't get to see the room tour if you don't want to watch like the whole long vlog that i posted um i posted on tiktok like a little mini daily vlog so then you can see it like a lot quicker in there if you like and i i am so also this trip you guys we have no required social postings okay so let's do a little brand trip tea really quick because i realized like a lot of people oops, sorry on my camera <sighs> we're gonna get a new tripod i swear i'm gonna order it at dinner swear on my life okay let me not say that because in case i forget but i'm going to order it anyways brand trip tea so i've only been on two <laughs> but i can talk about these two so normally not only are you invited on a brand trip, but if there is like social posting requirements, so like for example, three reels and three TikToks, or two reels, two TikToks, and that's it. And stories, and stories. A certain amount of Instagram stories. I can't remember. But anyways, so not only do they pay for everything. When I say everything, I mean they pay for your flight, your hotel, anything room service anything you order in the hotel massages anything that you want to do if you get there and say you're like oh my god i forgot every single charger that i own i forgot a light they will like send people out to go find you the things that you need like the type of experience i'm now taking custard from nars also and i'm layering this only right here though like in this inner corner part um like they really treat you like a celebrity i'm i'm not like i mean maybe not i don't know what celebrities get treated like i'm not a celebrity but the way that they treat me i feel like 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 a celebrity i'm like you think i'm important enough to where if i forgot my iphone charger then i'm gonna call you and tell you hey i forgot my iphone charger and i know you'll go get it because you're telling me you'll go get it but i wouldn't like me personally girl i'm gonna take my ass to cvs like please you know what i mean but like that's the type of shit like the trips be on you know what i mean so it's like legit i'm using this abh cream bronzer by the way so and i'm just kind of letting this concealer sit before i blend it out so boom so not only do they cover literally all of that basically when you come on these trips you shouldn't you don't spend a dime like even like you guys have seen how we've been going out like we went and got hookah last night we're going to get hookah tonight nars is paying nars bought me a hookah wait, wait. Yeah. yeah like crazy when you go out with these people all the drinks whatever you want to drink bottoms up bitch you can go in here and be like i want a bottle of dom perignon and they'll be like okay like it's quite literally insane so not only is the trip in it in itself just an experience you know what i mean i guess if you do it a lot maybe you're over it i don't know me personally oh i'm gonna take the trip every time i'm gonna take the trip every single time 
NARS, please, if you ever want me to go anywhere else, let me know. But anyways, so not only do they do that, but if you do have social posting required, like when I went to Lancome, how I had that, they pay you for that. So not only do they give you an all expense paid trip, but if you have any content that they are asking you to post, they pay you for that. So when I went to France, I was paid money to go to a new country that was also paid for. I said, oh, you bitches living a life. This is what y'all have been doing. This is the game. Cause I've never been, that was my first time. I was like, what? Girl. So with this trip with NARS, um, we didn't have any social posting required. So what they call that is they're like, of course we love it. It's highly encouraged, but it is not required. So you don't have to, like, I don't have to be doing this right now. I don't have to talk about the concealer. I don't have to post imagery. You know what I mean? I don't have to tag the brand. I don't have to do any of that. But number one, if I was doing my makeup, I was going to be using the NARS anyways. I could have been here with anybody and that would have been the concealer I, would, I was using. So, and then obviously like, I don't care what anybody says. Bitch, you flew me, y'all flew me to motherfucking New York. Put me in this lit ass new ass hotel. The Amman? <laughs> Baby, I'm posting. You don't even gotta add. Like, and they know that. Like, it's most people do. Some people don't. Some people are like, y'all not paying me. I'm not posting it. And that's fine. But me, I'm gonna post it. Purse. Personally, I'm gonna post about it. I'm gonna say thank you unless like I don't like it then okay, but I love this concealer So like look at how smooth You guys are gonna see earlier. My under eye is going to be like It's insane This um, is one size powder by Patrick Starr. He did his big one with this powder. I'm sorry. I Whoa NARS gave us a translucent powder too. I need to try it but um, I'm rushing so I just felt like that that is not the time for me to try new products so let me just hold off on that one. But I seen a lady on TikTok talking about it earlier, actually. So I'm putting lots of powder on, by the way, because I want to be nice and matte. I don't want to be shiny in any photos and stuff. But yeah, it's just been such a great trip being here. Um, me and Alyssa have been hanging out. I got to meet Monet. That's my girl. I'm so glad we got to meet because we've been like uh, internet mutual besties for a little minute. Okay, 723, we're doing good. Cheers. No, but these champagne glasses, who are these by? It's like really sexy. Now for bronzer, I'm using my Makeup by Mario. I actually use a lot of Makeup by Mario products. Okay, two. <laughs> my lips also have some Makeup by Mario in them. Uh, anyways, taking a big fluffy breath. My bronzer's probably looking like wild, but honestly, my bronzer always looks like, it looks wild. Let's just be for real. Um, okay, the contour, Zeno, same bronzer. Um, I'm just running. I have to face this way because of the light, y'all, sorry. And it's like also like, I can't lie, like coming on stuff like this and being around such other just like positive, I have to do my makeup while I talk, great creators who are so good at what they do, right? It And like being here in general, it like really lights a fire under your ass to just like, I gotta like, I, I got this. Like I gotta keep going, you know what I mean? Like I like for my nose to look kind of like, whoop at the end so then blending that out with the brush that i did my concealer with on my eyelids so i'm just basically taking whatever's left over of translucent powder and concealer and blending out my nose contour then after that i'm going to take this powder from charlotte tilbury now listen the first time i used this the first couple of times i hated this but i used it recently like maybe a week ago and I like loved it because I've been really into like a bright under eye lately. I don't know if y'all have been able to tell. So I'm taking my powder puff and I'm just dipping it in because this stuff is really strong so you don't need much. And then I'm literally pressing it only like right in the inner, like literally like right here. And this is just gonna brighten this area up like crazy. It's a little harsh, like it's kind of dramatic for the for my makeup but like i don't know i've just been like really enjoying it and then i take my finger and i know this also probably sounds weird but i'm taking my finger and i'm just like melting this area like right there i love it i love it love it love it for blush i'm using this nars orgasm foreplay blush quad so this is the darker one they have two one has like lighter colors in it but i like this one this is got swinger orgasm x orgasm and orgasm rush so I use these bottom three colors in this one. I like mix all of them. Uh, I feel like this goes really well with my tan now that I have a tan. I don't know, blush got really weird for me once I got this like tan. I, I All of my blushes were looking like 
wild like I was looking clownish to me so um, when I got this I seen this darker color right here and I was like oh this would be perfect so and this is also a makeup by Mario brush so singing pretty this is um, F2 by the way that's the name of the brush now back to the eyes I'm actually using a lot of NARS products but I'm not using these guys I brought this with me I brought this with anyways I don't need to convince y'all y'all watch my videos you know uh, my NARS climax liner for my little inner corners y'all know the T and my eye since I've been here y'all my left eye sorry I have to be like quiet has like randomly been watering which is so weird and it's been fucking up my liner so I'm hoping like that doesn't happen today okay ow um then I'm gonna spray my face with the Charlotte Tilbury airbrush setting spray I should have did that before I did my inner corner but too late now taking these clips out of my hair so we can figure out what we're doing with this hair i'm trying to debate if i'm going to attempt to like curl it again but i'm gonna be real with y'all to me it really doesn't make sense other than like for content because it freaking falls because of like it's kind of the weather here it's like not gloomy but let me pull my lip products out too oh i have a new lip combo y'all that i've been obsessing over and y'all know i pretty much wear the same lip combo all the time but now that i'm tan y'all know my like my, the light pink that i always wear like i love my lips to be like really light pink um i can't wear it anymore because when i'm tan again clown so i had to like reshift and refocus into like a different like vibe on the lips and i found it and i'm in the so i can't wait to show up oh you know what's crazy i'm not doing my makeup again this is the last time i'm doing my makeup in new york and we're getting lit tonight it's Alyssa's birthday too and i'm like we went hard last night i'm not gonna i'm not gonna fucking lie me monet and Alyssa were the last of the girls to leave the fucking Uga lounge we're sickos no like we're really sick in the head so yeah after standing up i really don't don't think i'm going to i'm just gonna recurl like the front like my bangs so let me do the edge control before i curl that way this hair can be out of the way mm, my hair is from hot hair oh so do you guys see how my hair is like doing like this on the first day i looked insane because you see okay so my hair can't go like this it makes my forehead look like it just makes my face look crazy so i curled my hair wrong so my hair was curled like this right when it needs to be curled like this you see the difference oh girl i was fucked up my hair looked crazy day one and i felt so bad because that was like the first impression day and i was like <laughs> everybody thinks i look crazy no one thought i looked crazy but me but you know personal personal preference okay it was not the vibes this edge brush is fucking disgusting i actually should not touch this to my face i'm not gonna show it to you guys because y'all ain't finna talk about me i need I, whoa this is whoa has it always been like this? What the hell? I do not recall that. Okay, 7.32. Okay, if I can finish filming in 10 minutes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. We'll be good. Um, I scoop out my edge control. This is the gummy edge control, the best edge control in the world. And I put it in like little containers, whichever I can find at the time. So this just happens to be the one that I'm using on this trip. I'm not putting Sol de Janeiro in my hair, I promise. Boom. Edges are done are they swimming wow this this curling iron is hot as hell whoa okay hold on there we go because what no all right that's gonna fry my hair off for sure cheers so like i said i'm just gonna curl the front pieces so that they can lay right everything's gotta be done right especially with this freaking middle part if it was a side part i can get away with a lot more i'm a side part girl like side part to me just looks the best on me but i've had this middle part for a little bit so you see now it's curling how it's supposed to instead of curling like this do you see the dip like look at the you can literally look at my head and see the difference that this is doing for my face or maybe you can't and it's just me but i feel happy i feel like we got the curl down it's fine honestly i'm telling you like i'm not about to put energy <laughs> into this it's not it doesn't even matter my curling iron is a t3 by the way an inch and a half barrel and i'm taking a little bit of bio silk oil because my hair is can't lie pretty crispy so just a little bit 
starting from the ends working my way up definitely making sure I'm getting like my real hair up in here some hairspray this is big sexy hair and I'm just big sexy hair isn't my choice of hairspray this was just the only mini that they had and I wasn't bringing my giant Kenra hairspray so I'm just kind of like lifting the hair up and spraying into it just to kind of get like some volume um, in the hair so we don't fall flat. Mm hmm we're looking good. Okay, lips time. Um, so I'm using, of course, my Refi Lip Liner in the shade Fawn. And I don't line my lips like normal. I overline, of course. I don't know if you guys can see like, I don't know if that's filler or our lips, but mm -hmm. I have like little booger flakes all in my nose. Like just little crushy booger kind of just hanging out at the entrance. Uh, I know, it's like a bat cave. Okay, after lip liner, I'm gonna use the Makeup by Mario. Um, this is the Moisture Glow Plumping Lip Serum in Petal Glow. It's my new fave. Oh shit, I forgot I squeezed it up too far. I'm just tapping that on the lip. Then for lip gloss, this is Patrick Ta in the shade Superficial Lip Gloss. So pretty. When I get from in front of here, you can see it better. Okay, it's time to get dressed. But just so y'all can believe me, here is the face not in that crazy lighting. I'm still like very yellow, like the lighting in here is very um, warm. Like the whole, you, you see the room, it's a very warm place, but yeah, we look good. I'm gonna get dressed and then show you the outfit. <laughs> All right, friends, let's get into the outfit. So this is what I'm wearing to dinner. Um, both my top and my skirt are from Isling Camps. If you've seen my charm haul, you've seen this. I'm so happy to be wearing it. Finally, I've been wanting to wear it for a long time. Oh, excuse my voice. I'm carrying my little YSL box. <laughs> and then I'm wearing my silver Dolce and Cabana pumps. Yeah. And then for my fragrance, I'm wearing Initio Musk Therapy. So good. I'm going to buy that full size. Okay. All right, y'all. Well, thank you so much for tuning in to today's video. I hope you enjoyed this Get Ready With Me. I'm going to go eat and drink and have a good old time with the team for the last night. So thanks for watching, y'all, and I'll see you in the next one.